And now, Duran Duran have just been inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Please welcome Simon Le Bon. How are you? I just, I just have to say, his name's not Rio and he doesn't dance on the sand. I have gone. <laughs> <laughs> um, Simon, congratulations on that and your cardigan, which we'll get on to. I love that. Um, now, out of all the awards that you've won in yes. those 40 years, yeah. right, how does this one compare? Because this must be up, what, up there with the Are best. Talking about the Rock and Roll... Yeah, Hall of Fame. Hall of Fame. Before, we used to call it the Hole of Shame, but, um, we'd, but it's one of those things... But now that, that you're in, now, you well, change your mind. That's the thing, you see. It's one of those, it's, it's that club where, well, we're never going to get invited to be part of that club, are we? But as soon as you get nominated, you start thinking, oh, maybe, maybe we could, maybe we could be. And then suddenly you're in it and you think, yes, it's the best thing ever. <laughs> I mean, it's an amazing night. So many, you know, of your peers in the room. Robert Downey Jr. Oh, I know. gave you the award on the yeah. night. You performed with Dolly Parton. She asked you yeah. to now sing a song with her as well. I mean, how was it performing with her? Um, Dolly is one of the real icons of the industry. She, she leads away for all of us. Um, there's not anybody I know who doesn't like Dolly Parton. Um, she has such a love, a deep love and affection for her audience, and the vehicle for that love is her music. Mm. And to be able to join her and, and, and be part of that thing was wonderful for yeah. me. It was very exciting. Mm. I, she could have just asked me to play the triangle and, and I would have said yes. Oh, we're big fans of Dolly. Yeah. She's so lovely, she really isn't is she? Wonderful. Now, despite all the success that you've had as a band, the thing about you guys, you're always moving forward, always doing new music. Yeah. Do you still find it as thrilling, as exciting now as when you started? There's bits of it that, that you get used to. <clears throat> like the travelling. That, that, that gets hard, that kind of gets more difficult. Mm. But there are bits that just get more and more exciting the, the more you do it, because you get better at it, like going on stage and performing. You know, the shows have now become such a... We used to go on tour and think it was all about the parties after the show. Now it's the show that's the focus of every minute of our day. And, and, and you treasure those moments on stage, the kind of connection that we have with our crowd. You know, to be able to see people and make them feel good about themselves, mm. it's, a, it's a wonderful thing. Mm. Yeah, well, you're speaking of touring. I mean, you're, you're about to go on tour again. You've added more dates. Yes. Uh, let's have a look at what's in store for the audiences. Well, Nicola has just emailed in. She says, thank you, Simon. The joy Duran Duran has brought me throughout my life, I'll be forever grateful for. I can't wait to see you at the O2 in May. I'll be the one on the front row. Right. Go. There you are. You look out for Nicola. Uh, I will. I'll see you. And if fans can't get to see you live, you've got this documentary, yeah. haven't you? Which yeah. gives everybody a real sort of understanding of what it's like when you put performances together and go on the road, etc. What can you tell us about that? Well, it's called a Hollywood High. And um, it's really, it's really, it's got a lot to do with our kind of relationship with Hollywood and Los Angeles. You know, we've been going there since 1981. Um, and we played a show on a rooftop there, overlooking the Capitol Tower, which was our record company, yeah. which we bathed in the, the, the flag of Ukraine, just to make a statement and show support. Um, we do interviews and you get to, get to know a little bit more about the band. It's fun. Nice. It's, it's good music. Yeah, great music. Now, Birmingham holds a very special place yeah. in your heart. Yeah. Uh, you guys got to perform at the, the Commonwealth Games, the, the opening ceremony, yes. which was amazing. And also, you've given uh, an Aston Villa player uh, your seal of approval. Is that right? Have I? Yeah. Which one? Yeah, uh, uh, well, we've John Duran. Here you go. Oh, right, OK. Yeah. Yeah. That's, that's more John Taylor. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, well, actually, the, 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 the Villa fan in the, in the band is, is Roger Taylor. Yeah. Big Villa fans. So he's, he's had a roller coaster ride. Mm. <laughs> As have most Villa fans. <laughs> um, Simon, thank you very much. Um, tickets for Duran Duran's tour, Future Past, are available now. Yeah.